It's your boy Big Red here for the Fast Food Fat Man. I want to welcome all my, the Big Red Food Army and all my new subscribers. I want to welcome all of y'all. Welcome boys and girls, ladies and gents. You know, I did a video last week. I went to a place and y'all all kept telling me I was eating the food wrong. So where am I at again this week? I'm at Jollibee's. Uh, and I'm gonna eat the chicken, I'm gonna do the fried chicken the Filipino way. Y'all told me I need to dip this in the brown gravy because I had no idea what the brown gravy was for. Cause in America, we don't, we don't eat our chicken with brown gravy. So uh, I'm gonna go ahead and knock that out. Let's see uh, what we got here. They got uh, some combos here with the chicken joy. Let's see. Uh, two pieces with one side and a drink. They got two pieces side a drink for a different price. I don't see. I'm not understanding this here. Oh, that's two sides. Never mind. I don't need two sides. I just need one. What they got for sides? They got steamed rice, mashed potatoes, buttered corn, and french fries. So, uh, we'll do the two, we'll, we'll, I guess we'll do the two sides. Let's see. Hi, Jolly Afternoon, Jolly Green. Hello, how are you today? I'm good, how are you? I'm doing great now that I'm here. Mm -hmm. um, I would like to get your uh, two-piece chicken okay. jolly, the, the chicken jolly two-piece. Sure. With, with two, I, I want the one with two sides. Two sides. Yes, ma'am. Okay, and your side order? I would like to try, what, what are my options again? I have rice, fries. Corn or mashed potatoes. Let me do mashed potatoes and corn. And corn. I'm sorry? Mashed potatoes and corn. And corn. Okay. And your drink? And what are my options? We have the Pepsi products, so we have pineapple juice. Um, you know, do you have the lemonade? The Pepsi, the, the uh, Pepsi lemonade? No, we have um, pink lemonade. That'll be fine. Okay. You want to add a peach mango pie to go with your order? I sure would. That's all? Well. Yes, ma'am. Okay, so you got the two piece, two sides, with mashed potatoes and corn and the pink lemonade. And that's spicy. And one peach mango pie. Yes, ma'am. Spicy. That's the spicy one, right? You said spicy? Yes, ma'am. Sure. Okay, try for it. Thank you. Okay, thank you. You're welcome. All right, so we're gonna try. We tried the we tried the regular last time, and it didn't have much flavor. But then again, I wasn't dipping it into the uh, into the gravy like y'all had told me. So we're gonna have to rectify that situation. Oh, I went too far. Hold on, let me back up a little bit here. All right. So let me get the old, uh... Wow, they even take... Check this out, y'all. They even take, uh... I like your, the color of your car. Oh, thank you. Thank you. Cool. They take, um... Look at the, the, uh... They take American Express... MasterCard, Visa, Discover, and Union Pay, which is some Asian 
credit card. Check that out. And we're in America. Wow. <laughs> that's pretty cool that they take the credit card from, I guess that's Union Pay. I think that might be Filipino or from the Bank of Philippines. I don't know. Could y'all tell me down there what that is? I don't know. I have no idea. Yes, ma'am. All right, so. What's that? In the fish pie. Yes, ma'am. $9.70. Okay. All right, so here's the bag of goodness. Can you please sign for me, sir? Yeah, sure. They want my autograph. Look at that. <laughs> did you shampoo your beard, sir? What's that? I'm sorry? Did, did you ask if you shampooed your <laughs> yeah, I shampoo my beard every every day, <laughs> every day. I don't have hair up here, so I shampoo, I shampoo that. <laughs> okay, thank you. You too. All right, so there we go. So let's pull up to our little parking spot, and uh, let's go ahead and pull into a little parky park spot. And let's get our grub on. All right. So, we got us a little parky park spot. We're going to put the old camera up here. All right, so, let's, uh, undo this here. Oh, it's hot as balls. And I'm in, it's, it just turned, we're, we're what, April the 2nd? No, April the 3rd. And it's already 91 degrees here in Houston. It's ridiculous, retarded hot. Okay, so we got mashed potatoes and gravy. We got Buku napkins. Let me put my credit card up here. Let me put my mashed potatoes down here for a minute. Our receipt. Put the old debit card away. We got that wonderful pie. I like. I enjoyed it so much last time. I got one this time. I think I'm, that's going to be my regular thing. I'm going to get it every time I come here. We got a fork, we got a spoon, we got a pie. They didn't give me no extra gravy, at least I don't think so, so. Oh, there it is. There's the extra gravy. All right, so. Let's get this here spoon. Make life easy. I'm gonna eat the corn first. If I was sitting inside, I'd probably do a little switchy switch between this and that and all right the corn it's definitely just like any other places corn Nothing special about it.
So let me see what this ran me. Six ninety nine plus a dollar ninety nine for the pie. So that's eight. That's seven and two is nine. Nine dollars and some change for two pieces of chicken. My order taker's name. Good lord, check this out. I had weed for my my order taker. Her name is. Let's see if we can get that in there, zoom in. I don't know. I don't know, but her name is Mary Jane. Just like the candy and the weed. Oh crap, piece of corn fell. I'm going in to get it. I got it. I don't know. I'm going to have to look on Popeye's website to see how much their two-piece and two-piece, two-sides are. Because I think this is a little high. Okay. We knocked out that corn. So now... We got the gravy, and we know what to do with it this time. Thanks to all of you guys. Thanks to all my Filipino viewers who told me that the gravy is for the chicken. I had no clue. But what's funny is, I, I don't know, I've gotten so many comments on that last video I did that I don't remember who it was that told me you know, some people say you put it on the rice or put it on the, ch dip the chicken in it. Okay, I get it. But one person, I don't remember who it was. I'll have to see if I can go through all the comments and find out. Wow, this is on here pretty good. Um, guess I don't want you to spill it, which is nice of them. So anyway, the one viewer and one person that commented said that the uh how you call it that the um uh what am i thinking of that you dip the dip it in the in the gravy the, the chicken but they thought that all americans did that because jolly bee is based off of American restaurants and I wrote back to the person I said no in America we don't do that we we dip our chicken in either nothing or ketchup okay so we got some skin with some gravy Try some of the skin without the gravy. Let's see how spicy it is. I mean, it definitely the chicken jolly or chicken joy, whatever it's called. Spicy is way better, more flavor than the plain. The plain was kind of eh. The spicy has actually got a good flavor even without the gravy. So we dipped our chicken in the gravy here. I never would have thought of putting chicken, fried chicken and gravy. I mean, I've had other kind of chickens with gravy. And all it is is like brown mashed potato gravy. Oh, 
This is damn good. Who would have thought? Chicken and gravy would go together. I mean, this is definitely a Filipino thing because we don't do this in America. Like if you go to churches or Popeyes, you get gravy with your mashed potatoes. But you don't get gravy with your chicken. This is amazing. Unbelievable how good this is. I mean, if my mama and my grandma were still alive, I might have to slap them for not serving me gravy with my fried chicken. All my American viewers, if you got a Jollibee's near you, go give this a try. Or make you some fried chicken and get some brown gravy. Because this is by far amazing. And take it from a fat man. If a fat man tells you something tastes good, you can take that to the bank. You can put it in your pipe, you can smoke it. Because it's true. I wonder if Jolly Bees, I don't know if they do tenders. Like fried chicken tenders dipped in mashed potato gravy. This is a whole nother animal. Good Lord. Well, what about... I'm thinking of all kind of other chickens I could dip in this gravy. Like a wing joint. Instead of getting like... Uh, lemon pepper or... Instead of getting like the buffalo sauce. Toss that bitch in brown gravy. Dude, I am so down with this. Yeah, my grandma and my mama are lucky they're not alive because I might have had to go slap them for not serving me chicken like this. But yeah, this is definitely a Filipino thing because it's definitely not an American thing. That's why I was so shocked when all of you... Uh, people commented and saying that it was for the chicken or the rice and I could understand brown gravy and rice because I've had that before but I've never had fried chicken and gravy before I was like totally confused when y'all kept saying it's for the chicken now I know and I And no one's half the battle, G.I. Joe. Alright, one piece is down. Let's bang out this other one.
But I mean, as far as regular fried chicken goes, they're spicy. It's a way different spice than Popeyes or Churches or any other fried chicken joint spice. Way different. This is amazing. Well, it looks like a little Jolly Bee employee coming to work here. She got her little uniform on. She got her little backpack on. She got a hat on. I want a Jolly Bee hat. Yeah, this gravy's freaking banging with this chicken. Never would have thought it. It's kind of messy to be for eating fried chicken in my car, but it's for you guys. Well, the chicken's for me, the video's for you guys. Because I think I might have to break your finger you try to steal my chicken. Or I might eat one of your fingers. Who knows? You put your fingers too close to a fat man while he's eating? You don't know what's going to happen. You might come back with only nine fingers. But yeah, this is super banging. Well, I'm so fat if I broke my leg, maybe gravy will pour out. There's a big old piece. Look at that. Dip that in there. I'm kind of sad I didn't get a whole bucket now. And there's some little bitty pieces that fell up into the... Up in there. I'm going to spoon them out because I got a spoon. And I still got my mashed potatoes and pie to get down with. And this is, man, look at all these little crumbs. Get all that goodness. I might need to be hosed off after this. I'm going in with the spoon. Oh, only two pieces broke off in there. But we still got a little gravy left. <sighs> Not anymore.
that was banging. Alright, so let's close this. Let's uh, take a sip of this here drink. Definitely gonna have to get hold of this I took it as greasy. Wipe up my little mess here. Let's get down with some mashed potatoes. A little bit still on the roof. I'm gonna let that go to waste now. Okay, so let's get that gravy mixed up in there. And all this time I've been sitting here, it's Mashed potatoes been sitting here. He's still hot as hell. Man, yeah, mashed potatoes are just kind of lumpy. Could have used a little more gravy to help them out. Okay, so the mashed potatoes and corn, not real special. Spicy chicken on the other hand, with that gravy, That was fire. Like I said, mashed potatoes, nothing special. It's almost like an afterthought. So like, we need another side. Here's some mashed potatoes. We need another side. Here's some corn. All right, so. We bang that out. Now let's get down to business with this pie. I love this pie. This pie is amazing. Makes McDonald's apple pie look like a big dog turd. Because this is fire. So now that I've eaten the fried chicken, in a tradition of the uh, Filipino people, I don't know if I want to switch back to dipping it in ketchup. I don't know. Because that is amazing. This is amazing, too. I love this. I've been thinking about this pie for a week. Actually, a week and a day. 
I think it's been, I've been thinking about this pie. I've been thinking about this pie more than I've been thinking about, oh, I got to eat the, uh, the chicken, the Filipino way. You know what I'm saying? It's, uh, this pie is amazing, y'all. I live like 27 miles away from here. I don't know if in the Philippines y'all use miles or kilometers, but in the U.S. we use miles to, to judge distance. And I live 27 miles away from here. Going through some of the most ridiculous traffic in the Houston area just to get here. But you know what? It's worth it. So, with that being said, now that I've eaten the Chicken Joy, the Filipino way, let's rate this here. Okay. Let's turn off my, my car. Quit wasting gas. Okay, so the corn, it was corn. It wasn't that great. It was just an afterthought. Uh, I'm going to give the corn like a 2.5 flip-flop, 2.5 flip-flop. The mashed potatoes, I'm going to give you a three flip-flop. But that chicken and gravy... Give y'all four flip-flops. Four. Maybe four four point two five flip-flops. Cause the chicken and gravy is freaking blowing my mind. That peach pie, you get in a five. You drink, it's just, you know, it's a drink. Nothing special. Get it at every restaurant. Nothing special. Just drop a can of lemonade. Uh so with that being said. My overall experience this time, I'm going to say 4.5. We'll round it up to 4.5. <clears throat> it was amazing. I don't know if I'll ever eat fried chicken the same as I used to ever again. I'm going to ask, hey, where's the gravy? So, then there's a subscription button. Click it. Become part of the Big Red Food Army. You'll know when I have new content. Open up the description box. There's a bunch of links in there. Link to follow me on Facebook, YouTube, and, uh, I'm sorry, Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter. Also, there's a link to my homepage on YouTube so you can find my older videos. The same thing, just at different restaurants. Um, buffets and fast food joints. Uh, I want to thank y'all for hanging out with your boy, Big Red. Uh, I appreciate all of y'all who told me that you got to go back and you got to try it with the gravy. You got to, you got to. Well, I did, and I did it for you, and guess what? I love y'all for that suggestion. I love it. Good stuff. So, as always, tell your ma, tell your pa, tell your greasy, greasy grandma, share this video with your family and friends, and I'll see you guys next time in the fast food line. This has been Big Red for another fast food fat man. I'm out. Thanks for watching. Mm -hmm.